Hello, 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 everybody. This is RCK bringing you your next Gath episode. So let's go ahead and jump on into our turn 12, the very end of our first year. I wonder if Pythium's been stalling. I'm not sure. So we have two battles here. We'll go ahead and watch the first one. This one should be in that uh, wasteland here, so very sketchy. Um, maybe these guys fatigue out being so cold. Looks just looks snowy. I don't know if it's actual cold in the province or not. We'll have to check. Hope so. Ah, uh, they're hitting us hard. They're mixed in. Ooh, looks like we got the route on them. We're taking care of those busy infantry though. Okay, okay. They were not as big as a threat as I thought they were gonna be, guys. Um things turned out very, very well for us. Um we took two Gadite soldier losses. Good. Our gibbers were definitely putting in the work there. And turned out the Avizan infantry only killed one. So, very good. Salamander did nothing. The adapt, uh, Adept didn't do nothing at all. So, awesome. We watch another battle here with Atlantis. So, let's go ahead and watch this. I think it's the same army we saw last time. We just guessed correctly on where they're heading to. Not much here to fight. Took two losses. Got some earth gems, got some more earth gems, finished our giant palisade, and we had an affliction that was cured. Awesome. So definitely want to start working on a palisade over here as soon as we can. Let's go ahead and build a scout. Um, because we're going to want this waste here. Uh, we need to build this too. 450 gold. Oof, we need some more money. So this... Oh... That's not cool. I assume they moved back here due to the fact of us leaving our guys here for one turn. Probably still not a smart move. Mm -mm -mm -mm. See Joman over here? I don't remember if Rob C's playing Joman or not. I don't remember. Who, who's playing Joman? I just feel like I saw him say he was playing Joman. It might be a separate game we're playing in that he's playing Joman. I think he's a pretty good player before. I, I don't think I've played against him too many times. I think one time maybe, but we never really had a war or anything like that. No, it's uh, Faye. It's actually the person that made the uh, this game that we're currently in. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Hope they do well. Alrighty. Probably want you on a box. Like over here. Hold and attack. Hold and attack. Hold and fire. Have you in a. Ooh, do I want double line? I want line. I mean, I'd love to keep you guys in the middle, but it's kind of awkward. Should I put them on sparse line, then have them followed up here by these fellows? I don't want you to get hit by the magic spells, though. Hmm. <laughs> lots to think about. Lots to think about. So we have a nature 2 and an earth 2 over here. Go ahead and set you guys a search. Uh, wish we had some more nature gems. Can we cast luck? Yes, we can. Cast spells. Is there anything else we actually want to cast? Eh, protection, eh. We had a bigger size protection spell, yeah, but not not just AoE one. I mean, we could, but um, we could cast other things like Gift of the Hair, give them double combat speed, so they're hitting twice as fast, I believe. Yeah, combat speed is doubled. Hmm. We'll take one more. Having these guys in here with all these shielded gibbers, we should be okay. Shouldn't have to worry about 
um, random arrows and things as such. Hmm. Interesting they didn't take these yet anyway. Yeah, they must have been worried we were going to attack them there. From what I heard, Pangea was going to help us, but they got attacked by somebody else. I was like, oh, okay, whatever. Whatever. Well, if only we could attack through that province right there. I mean, possibility we could move, uh, take this first. But... I think we need to get into an early war as fast as we can. I just feel like our troops are stronger. Um, I feel like we'll do much better in a fight. What are we Richard? going for enchantment four? You can random hive. We'll do that for right now. Because we do need to get a double fire here. Just having the ability to cast, um, I thought, well, if we get a, or such, when you get blood one. So, yeah, we're, I mean, we're too far away for enchantment four anyway, but, um, maybe that'd be something we will have to do when we get to their cap. So I don't, I, I don't think we need to get, go ahead and, um, cause I mean, they're still, uh, one and three or a two and three chance that we won't actually get the fire random anyway So probably not worth spending the cash on that at the moment Instead Let's go ahead and put it on our astral And then get another Kohen uh, Take one of those guys off so we can upgrade the fort this turn as well Go ahead and get that started. Actually. There we go. Um, we probably should have attacked Calum, honestly. Probably would have been okay. We could have talked to Joman. I'm sure they would have joined in with us. They're always looking for more land. We can try to grab the shipwreckers. See if we can grab the pit right there. Oh, we don't have enough gold. Never mind. Interesting, interesting. I'm sure Atlantis is going to take this anyway. And honestly, um, with him having such a, a big area, I mean, I know he's going to have all this water. He's going to have this water. He's going to have this land here in the middle. I'm, I'm okay with that, because that just proves that Atlantis is a bigger threat than I am, since he'll be harder to, for us to get him out of the water, um, lots of other things. It, we can just show him as a bigger threat compared to everyone else, compared to me, while I hopefully get my blood economy running. We're recruiting... Oh, we can just move one that we already have there. Uh, since we don't have the gold, he might as well keep moving. And we saved a little bit of gold there. We can't add another one, can we? Yes, we can. Okay. What is? How much can y'all move? Ten. Leadership of ten. Really? Ten. Garbage. Garbage. Eighty-five. One hundred thirty gold for nine research. Sixty-five gold for nine. I mean, yeah, more cost effective to do that, but I'd rather do something. Like this, so we have another commander next turn to start moving out troops. I think this will be more beneficial. Same amount of research points. Um, moving us, starting our blood economy a little bit uh, faster, I guess. I'll be definitely making these 65 gold units out of this province or every other castle that I make. Just as of right now, I want to get uh, at least a good handful of blood mages to go ahead and get them somewhere and start them on the hunting. I mean, we can stay small and try to go from there but um, i feel like our givers our giants are just gonna do so well i mean yeah he's gonna have wardens i mean we'll go look at them vampire queen um 
Yeah, they're going to have uh, 24 damage, uh, sword, or swords with slash damage, crossbow heavy unit, or crossbow heavy uh, armies. I don't know. Probably not that great, but not that great for us. I mean, other than how oh, they had their tower guard. Looking at it as a 2v1 was fine, but now that I'm not in a 2v1 anymore. I might just move to take this first, um, reassess things after that, I don't know. I'm just glad we got this. We could go after Pythium. That's a good idea too. Looks like they've expanded fairly poorly. Finally took that province. I mean, we can move here. Four hundred ninety. Okay. Fifty-five supply. I'm making sure our supply isn't garbage because we're gonna hit this mountain. And it's gonna not be fun. Or we're gonna hit that swamp, and it's not gonna be fun. Construction two. Eh. We need to get. Some of these Astra fellows out site searching. You're site searching there. Make sure you are. Okay. And maybe we'll hit Pythium with surprise here. Because we'll be looking right into his cap circle. Hopefully Atlantis doesn't try to take any off of us. And I don't... Let's look at what Pythium has. Serpents. Hydras. They have the sacred Hydras. I mean, yeah, they have the poison, but our giants have a decent enough HP pool that I think we'll be able to end the battle quick enough... To where it's not going to affect us as much. Yeah, they have javelins, but so these Retarius are gonna blow. But he might have what one, two turns of recruitment for him. Because he's definitely not making them right now. Hmm. I didn't know they got a blessed bonus of poison resistance. Cool. Let's look at our HP. 38, yeah. Protection, 14. We have shields. Um, decent parry on them. Yeah, we're probably better off like that. And honestly enough, we could, we could cast things like... Body Ethereal instead, and that might actually do us even uh, much better than casting Luck. Just due to the fact of them probably not having magic weapons on anything. Do they even have... I mean, they have their Night Guys, but I highly doubt they are making them. Looks like they went mostly scale. Heat 3. I don't know. Maybe they took a strong chassis on the Pretender. But why would they have such a weak expansion? It could open up as a turn or as a dormant pretender. Do we see anything? No. Stay there for a turn or two. I want you to go over here. Ooh, Vanheim. Oh, no, that's Midgard. My bad. I don't know, not going into the man fight as a 2v1, uh, kind of bothersome. I mean, it looks like he went in a circle, almost. Uh, he must have went, bam, 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 around here. Because I remember his army being over here, moving through, moving through. He took this CAD, took over here, and then moved back as he saw my army set their turn. So, that's probably what happened. I should send a message be like, um, 
ask him if he wants a nap or something, but Heavy Cav. I uh, will get ping that throne. And that still puts us in. Oh, you can. Uh, who's. It's gonna be these giants, yeah. What is the actual map movement? Uh, 16, no, 13. Oh, goodness. Uh, so little, but yet so far away. Yeah, I'm, I can't take the throne in his cap circle and be like, oops, my bad, sorry, I didn't see you there. Because then he'd just want it. I wouldn't want to give it to him. <laughs> Quite well organized. Yeah, he went around the heavy calf. But from my assumption is this is probably all he owns. He might own this, but I doubt it. If he hasn't finished taking some of his cap circle yet, yeah, I know he hasn't taken these two. Taken these two. Yeah. How many turns till we get to one? Two, three, four. Four turns to the cap. I mean, we can probably just go straight for the cap, honestly. Our seed strength is relatively high on these units. Hmm. At the same time, Pythium be nice to grab too. I feel like... I mean, they're going to have air elementals and bullshit like that, but Pythium's going to have astral... Well, I mean, they'll have astral communions, but I don't know. They have different kinds, you know. Let's look again. They just have a lot of bullshit. They have a lot of access to everything. Water, death, nature. Is it just water, death, nature, astral? Access to weak mages of all paths. Interesting. Where's fire? Oh, there's fire. They don't have, uh, they're not part astral, but I mean, they could put a matrix on them. The heretics. Same for all these. Blood. There's more fire. Leo. Hmm. From the units that it looks like he's using, they just don't seem as strong as Man's Sacred Say currently has. Not that I'm honestly too scared of them. It's just due to the fact that they they just hit hard, and I don't know what their bless is. So I can on. So. Size 3 and 4 has a chance to negate. Size plus 5 always negates. Strength 15 plus has a chance to negate. Strength 35 always negates. So, what's our strength? Strength of 19, and then we go plus 4. Oh, he's diseased. There's only one disease. I wonder if there's... There's got to be something around here. We'll have to look. I don't see any death scales anywhere. We'll have to keep an eye on that. This did come with a lava lake, which is kind of nice. Gym income going up a little bit, even though we haven't searched yet. Hmm. Jar Bless is plus four strength, isn't it? Yes. No, it's plus eight strength. Oh, my goodness. I really forgot about that. So we're going to go from. 19 to 27. And what was it? Oops. Thirty-five always negates. Ah. 
I mean, we're, we're going to be very, very high. We're, there's going to be a good chance that we do negate. I mean, 22 pierce is no joke. Wardens and longbowmen. Ah, tough decision. Really? Ah, oh, it's because there's a road. That's why. Mm-mm-mm. Unless man preemptively attacks us here, I feel like we're going to go after Pythium. Because I know Pangea is doing his thing. I'm sure man wants to research or do turtle up, do whatever he wants to do. I doubt he's going to attack us early. But Pythium, weak expansion. From the looks of it anyway, I, mean, I, I don't actually know what's over here. But I can message Pangea, and I can see, but honestly, I mean, for a while he didn't have most of this taken. Hmm. I think that's going to be our turn 12, guys. There's a lot to think about. I'm sorry the video lasted for so long. Um, just had to sit here and really think about it. Sometimes these turns are really short. Sometimes they're really uh, fast just to, just because, I mean, some turns you don't have to think much. Some turns you have to think about a lot of things. Early early, early wars, early targets. I mean, it's a lot to consider. So uh, did I put PD in that province? Yes, I did. Okay. So um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, guys, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.